Hey, Kanan. What you doing? Are you playing with your blocks, huh? You playing with your blocks? Oh my goodness, what a bad head. Yeah. Yeah. Good evening. It's coming up on 5.30. Uh, he just got up from his second nap. Yeah. He's been playing with his little blocks. And there we go. Yeah, you've been playing with your blocks. He, he loves d dumping them out. Yeah, don't ya? Don't ya, big boy? Yeah, hi. Apologies for not coming to you guys sooner in the day, but I figured I'd better get some things accomplished rather than focus on talking to a camera. And I actually did get some things accomplished, including in the area of self-care, which has been sorely lacking over the entire weekend, which is probably why I did not vlog all that much last week, because I wasn't able to do self-care like I wanted. Anyway, uh, I was finally able to do some of that today, finally able to draw something. It turned out horrible, but at least I got it out of my system. Um, clearly I need more practice. Wasn't able to do any music practice, but... Um, I was able to sort of reread one of my old pieces of fan fiction that I may just revisit. I'm not sure. Oh, hi, Manoli. Hey, puppy. Hi, pretty girl. Mwah. So, yeah, hanging out with the dog and the cat and the baby, of course. It's still pretty hot. Um, gas prices went down 10 cents over here. I don't know if they're going to go down further, but since I mentioned it, they probably won't because that's how Murphy's Law works. <laughs> anyway, um, I was, uh, like I said, I was able to do some self-care, some artwork, some skin care. It's still not perfect, as you can see, but it's definitely better than it was. Um, I'm probably going to be making dinner. The original plan was to make chickpea burgers, but I don't think that's a good idea, given the fact that... Um, I've been off and on the toilet all day, if that's not TMI. And, uh, yeah. Hi! Hi! I've also been farting up a storm, so the last thing I need is legumes. So, I may do something with the turkey that's thawed in there. I don't know. I was planning on making tacos tomorrow night. Maybe I'll make them chicken instead of turkey. I don't know. Oh, somebody's reaching for the camera. Somebody's reaching for the camera. You can't have the camera, young man. You can't have the camera, young man. Oh, by the way, over the weekend, he cut his fifth tooth. You got so many toofies. Yeah, you got so many toofies. You gonna put that in the bucket? You gonna put that in the bucket? Or are you gonna dump it out? You gonna put it in the bucket? Oh, so close. And that's the dog's nose in the foreground. Yeah, you like watching the doggy? You like watching the doggy, huh? Can you put it in the bucket? Can you put it in the bucket? Yeah, in the bucket. He's like, no, we'll just put it down. Oops. <gasps> put it in the bucket. Put it in the bucket. And there's the cat, of course. Yeah. Uh-oh. You put it in the bucket? Like that. See? You put it in? You put it in the bucket? He's been babbling a lot, uh, saying dada, insisting on saying dada instead of mama, which has me feeling just a little bit left out. But, um, you know, he's just a baby. He's just a baby. Nine months old, big boy. So, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make something for dinner. And then come back to you guys later. There you go, you'll put something in the bucket. Oh, two blocks in one hand. Yeah. Oh, does the green taste good? Does that green block taste good, huh? Oh my goodness, you grabbed it with your toofies and then dropped it. All right. He, by the way, is on his third outfit, as is his usual. Um, I'm going to make dinner and then feed the baby and then, of course, find out when exactly my husband's going to be home. Maybe we'll just make pasta. I don't know. But we are supposed to have pasta on Wednesday. Who knows? I don't think my husband's going to care much what we have. <laughs> as long as it eats food. Yeah, you rolling it? Yeah, you rolling it? <gasps> Look at you. Put it in the bucket. 
Put it in the bucket. Apologies if I'm focusing too much on my son, but he's so stinking cute, aren't you? Gonna put it in the bucket? <gasps> in it go? In the bucket. Oh, and you grab the star. Okay. I thought you were gonna put him in the bucket. <gasps> you put him in the bucket or are you just gonna drop him? Okay, watch. Once I turn the camera off, he's gonna put it in the bucket. Morning, folks. It's just after 9 in the morning on Tuesday, the 12th of July. I was just starting to edit last week's vlog, and oh, yes. As you can see, the program just crashed. And the baby won't nap. How's your morning going? When you just barely start editing something and the computer decides to crash, it's, I'm just gonna go for a restart and then try and get back to this. I'm hoping my son will fall asleep. I put him down for a nap at 8.30 because he woke up at 6 a.m. So we're gonna try that and then get back to our list. After I do the regular vlog, there's still a few things. Nothing terribly important, except for meal prep, but still, it's stuff to do. I don't know if I'm making much sense. I've had two cups of coffee. Maybe I need another one. Do a restart on the computer, try again, and I guess I'll come back once the editing is finished. Or when my son decides He's actually gonna sleep. Whichever comes first. Well, Murphy's Law. Two seconds after I restart my computer, I get a text message reminding me of something I completely forgot about, which is an in-home visit with a childhood specialist I've been meeting with for the last few months. Usually it's over Zoom, but she's actually coming here at 10.30. <laughs> and I just realized the floor is full of animal hair and we have a pile of dirty dishes so instead of starting the editing like I was planning on I gotta do some cleaning because even though she says oh it's no big deal I don't like people coming over especially anybody with a rank and seeing a mess because it's embarrassing so I'll get that cleaned up and come back to you probably after the appointment truer words were never spoken news. It's 1.49 in the afternoon. The baby's napping. And we just finished editing last week's vlog. Which is not as exciting as I'd hoped, but at least there's some babies and birthday cake. If you're wondering what the noise is, that's the dog I'm trying to clean up after my son. There's that one done. I can't do anything else on the computer until that's done saving, so what do I have time for? Oh, I can't paint the X-Wing while the baby's sleeping. I'm vlogging right now. can't make hummus because it makes noise, so I guess artwork it is. Good morning, folks. It's coming up on 9.40 on Wednesday the 13th. Oof. It's already 86 degrees, and so I'm taking the dog for her midday outing. I'm gonna take her out, take her out again after the UV index has dropped a little bit by about 4.30ish, 5 o'clock, if I'm not in the middle of making dinner. 4 o'clock is the earliest, so, because I don't want all of us to fry. Ugh, it's humid today. It may decide to rain. I hope so. We've got several wildfires burning at the same time. Who is that? Okay. And I'm relishing every bit of shade that we get. Uh, mostly today is going to be another Mount Washmore day with all of my son's diapers and some new clothes that he got yesterday. Need to wash them before he puts them on. He's got a few more in the 12 month and a few more in the 18 month size, which it's blowing my mind that he's now 9 to 12 month size. It's just, he's getting so big. And in a little over two months, 
he's going to be one year old and I'm still trying to deal with that. Um, he's not walking yet, thank goodness. <laughs> thank goodness, yeah, thank goodness, because now he can't get into everything. It's a good thing because our, uh, our place is far, far from baby proofed. We've got a long way to go. Part of it is we can't figure out how exactly to baby proof when we live in an apartment with rules about how many holes you can drill. <laughs> so either we get some wood putty to fill in the holes after the fact, and of course it's back for the walls, or we uh, go with a combination of, oh, look out, <laughs> combination of command hooks and command hooks and something else I can't think of right now. Command hooks and elastics, which of course the cat will probably tear up, so we're probably just going to have to get some wood putty and spackle and then fill in the holes afterwards so we can get our deposit back. Goodness knows when that's going to be. Our lease has been extended until next May. So we don't have to worry about finding a new place until then. Hopefully the rent won't go up again. Oof. At any rate, it's definitely way too hot to be outside, but the dog needs a walk. And to be frank, I need the fresh air. So see you guys later. Hey baby. How you doing old lady, huh? Doing okay, hon? I know it's hot. Don't worry, we're gonna turn around soon and then go home. I know it's hot, babe. Poor kid. Poor kid. Poor baby. Right in front of the climbing club. It is too hot to go any further. In fact, it's probably too hot to have gone this far. I'm already sweating. Should have brought water. Maybe I'll do it next time. I'll go out earlier, but my dog is old and she can only hold it for so long. So we are headed home. Once we get in, we got lots of cold water, okay? Yeah, a poor old dog. Okay, so fast forward to 3.20 a.m. in the afternoon. I managed to wash all of my son's laundry, yay! Even though he's managed to dirty quite a bit more of it. <laughs> and reorganize a few things. I've been digging everywhere for a set of missing stickers that I've been looking for since the last time we went hiking, which I believe was probably three weeks now. I'm not sure. I lose track of time easily. Everything else on my list, apart from vlogging, I have not been able to do because Mr. Kane in here, Mr. is anti-nap. He's naps for a grand total of what, 45 minutes, an hour? And that's spread out over three attempts. I'm going to try one more time after we take the doggy out for her afternoon potty. Thankfully, it's getting pretty overcast out there. We've got roughly a 75% chance of thunderstorms. I don't know when that expires, but there are a few clouds building up over the mountains, and since it's overcast, it's not nearly as sunny and shiny as it normally would be. So I've got to clean up his face, put something back on my feet, and then we can take the dog out. And the final attempt at putting this child down for a nap that's more than 15 or 20 minutes. Ow, and I just slammed my finger on the table. That hurts. Uh-oh! Uh-oh, you dropped your cup. I guess that means you're done. And here comes the rain, accompanied with a warm wind. Yeah, somebody just finished his dinner. Ooh, it's coming down. I hope my husband doesn't get too wet. He's bringing home dinner, actually, because, I don't know, maybe I'm just lazy. <laughs> Storms are brewing! Now this is what I'm talking about. 
downpour. Oh, boy, I could do without the wind or the lightning. But whoa, this wind is absolutely insane. But the rain? Yeah, bring on the rain. More rain. More rain. We need all of the rain. Yeah, look at the way it's blowing. Oh my gosh, look at that. That's a gully washer. Look at all that rain. Holy crap, that's pretty insane. Wow. Hey, you go out and that you get soaked. Woohoo! Yeah. And we need it. Yeehaw. Boy, I'm very glad my husband is home and not out in this. What is that, Manali? Does that smell interesting? Whoa, this wind is absolutely insane. I may have to get my... Whoa, holy crap. I think I'm going to go inside now. Manali. All right. It is probably not showing up very well, but we have got a full double rainbow rocking out there. It goes all the way up and then all the way back down. And, of course, it's still thundering. But this is... The camera, of course, does not do it anywhere near justice. The, the outer part is definitely disappearing some more now. It is a little bit more visible on this side. Yep. There it is. Yeah, there we can. It's picking it up now. Whoa! Woo! One, two, three, four, five, six. Two miles. That is some thunder. I feel that in my feet. Hello! Yeah, thunder's coming from the brightest part of the rainbow. How about that? Well, the rain is definitely worth more than gold. Yes, it is. Especially during a super drought. Yep. That is very pretty, though. It ah, really is. Absolutely gorgeous. I figured you might want to see it. Yes, thank you for telling me. You're welcome, sweetie. What do you think, huh? You got to see your first double rainbow. Yeah. yeah! You got to see your first double rainbow at nine months old. Yeah! What, about, what do you think of that, honey? That's rain and wind. Yeah. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I thought I did. Hey guys, good afternoon. It is now Thursday the 14th uh, at 1.47. Uh, this little munchkin broke the mold by having a super long nap. Yeah, he fell asleep like 10, 20, and then slept till like 12, 30. So we went out and had a little outing in the shade, in the breeze. It's not nearly as hot as it has been. Plus, there's no sun shining in his face, so I figured we should be safe. And now he's having a very late lunch. Yeah, he hasn't seemed all that hungry, so. I wonder if he has a little cold, because he's been sniffling a little bit, and coughing a little bit, and sleeping more, so. He might have a little bit of a cold. I don't see a runny nose, but just hear some sniffles. Oh. Oh boy, yeah. He's having his crackers. And then he's gonna have some cottage cheese. Num num. Num 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 num. And I uh, have a little bit of a uh, to do list going here. And I have not done much of it. And I just now started vlogging. So maybe I can do one, two, three, four. The other four things on the list. Good afternoon, guys. It is now Friday, I think the 15th or 16th. I do not remember what day for sure. I think 15th, 16th, I don't know. It's either the 15th or the 16th. And um, it's been either cloudy or drizzling all day, which is nice. Of course, the trash stops by. Don't you dare wake up my son, you noisy, blasted piece of junk. Anyway, <laughs> I digress. Uh, it's been a fairly good morning. Last night I managed to get almost 3,000 words written in my fantasy epic that I haven't even touched in months. As the first significant writing I've been doing all year, which I feel like is a major accomplishment for me. Don't even, please, for the love of no. You gotta be kidding me. The trash truck's pulling in. The trash truck is pulling in. I just put my son down for an afternoon nap. The day was going so well. Now here comes the trash truck and I just find out 
My husband's coworker came into work with COVID. I am not even kidding. Wow. So um, we were gonna do shopping today, but uh, anyway, this just Murphy's Law. My son is napping, you jerks. <sighs> Pardon me. <laughs> Stop waking up my son! I just put him down. Screw me! Just screw me! The day was going so well. It was cooler. It was like in the high 70s at the most. It was cloudy all day. It was raining. And then everything went to heck. So. I'll come back later and let you know whether or not we've decided to actually follow through with our grocery shopping. 